Get on YouTube because that's when you get up. All right, guys. I, I think we are officially back again, and welcome back, guys. The DGHC Pumpernickel the Walks back again in this episode. Um, what we should have been doing. So this is this is number thirty-four. Last episode was like a mini part, it's, but this part we're gonna do what we should be doing. The last episode but we got finished up. World three. Four four will be the next episode of 3D World, so be ready for that. But anyways, in order to see more of them, I should hit that like button. You know, you know what to do. You know what to do in order to keep watching my videos because I said this in earlier parts. But if you're new here, you should know what to do. Like watch my order videos. Uh was, oh yeah. And now we're gonna start uh, feeling insulted and if he says anything that could harm anyone emotionally, racially, or sexually. Do not panic because I don't work for Google and I and don't plan on it because that's on the other side of the country and I don't want to deal with their garbage. I already have to deal with enough garbage out there, so deal with it. So anyways, without further ado, please welcome your artificial intelligence by feel insulted. Okay, Google, please insult me. Okay, for that, you might like feel insulted. Want to give it a try? Of course. Wow, I didn't think I would see you again. Welcome back to being insulted in a British accent then. You go girl, and don't come back. Say it, just say it. You need to be insulted again. No! Such a wuss, come back again and finish this. Alright, hey, you're here, alright. Is this on, oh, hold on, is this on Facebook? Okay, Google, tell me a scary story. Have you heard the urban legend about the power cord that was too short? About 10 years ago, there was this guy. I think his name was Henry. Anyway, he bought an alarm clock to put on his nightstand. But when he tried to plug it in, it was just too short. I hope that one doesn't give you nightmares. All right, now that we got that done, now we're going to get into this. So I, I try not to turn it up, but fill in my video. So let's now get into this. And tonight, uh, get ready for Jim Coast to get scarred again. But, uh, the car we're going to be using today. It's none other than me. It's actually my uh, me. Actually, this was my original me, but now this is my uh, new me. Because I like it. So deal with it. But now let's, let's get into this. And this is. I don't want. Uh, I'll be using this one. Whenever I use that me in my videos, I'm just going to do the normal suit, right? Because I don't feel like now the suit just looks weird on it. Those I know I got one comment when I used it that one episode. Uh, someone said that looks creepy. And I'm like, well, I don't know what to do for you. That I mean, I was, like an earlier part, maybe like number five, maybe it was when I made when they had because I know it was it wasn't number six because. That was back in June when I made that video. And so like how I was using a... Someone said I was using a back car. I mean, people are going to say I'm using back car combos. I, I've had people lie and say, you know that back car combo is bad? I mean, well, I use it anyway because... Just because it's bad, it's not going to... It probably won't affect my skill level that bad. I mean, it's... Cause if you know me, I'm pretty skilled at the game. And in my view of it, it's just... Whatever your skill level is, go with it. That's that's why most of these car combos, you see me put some random car combo together, and I'm actually doing pretty good by it because I'm, I've been playing. Give me a know. I've been playing Mario Kart since I was eight years old, so that would have been. Well, like. I'll, it's eight years right now, but when I, that means uh, 2010 is when I started, so that means. 
2019, that'll be nine years because I started playing Mario Kart Wii after the year after. Well, that's what that means. I played Mario Kart Wii first before Mario Galaxy because I didn't beat Mario Galaxy until 2011. That was when I 100 percent the, the game, but I I kind of I came back to it, and, but that's that will be coming to the channel. I think I will be streaming Mario Galaxy. One of these, one of these streams I might. Is that Mangalore? Is that Mangalore? Okay, I think that's Mangalore. Hey, you can tell I'm subscribed to him. He's man, he might be the one. If you look on my channel, you'll you'll probably see him. I think that's Mangalore. Alright, uh, Mangalore, you on the stream or no? No, I don't do this. Look, there's only one person. That is... Who is that? That's not the right Mangalore. That's the, that's a different one. Mangalore from the United States, the real one. The one I'm subscribed to is from New York. That's, that's just an impersonator. People will impersonate another YouTuber. Like they'll call themselves make war, but it's hard telling who's who, which one's which. Because I'll probably see like one person they make or I can say the real make a war or. But you know how it is with some of these. Some of these have players because. Like I was saying in previous parts, I mean, depending on what your skill level is, you got this thing called your VR account. That's what I'm trying to improve when I do worldwide races. I mean, I can, I don't know what your problem is, but quit saying you I'm wasting my time. Like, I remember when I said I'm only going to be doing tournaments in, these, in this series to be ready for, but I don't always do tournaments. You have to, you know, occasionally you will have friend rooms, that's the same thing, but it's with friends only. I might have like a couple people in there bring that. The hacker, I might include him in there. And I'm calling him the hacker because he said, well, that's the name I'm giving him because I don't want to, his name is, he's just going to be known as the hacker. Because I don't, I don't mention names on this video. I don't, why don't I mention names? Because if, if, okay, let's say I address someone like that. Everyone's gonna know. Well, if I you gave away his name, does that means I'm gonna go do something stupid. I mean, well, that's why I don't do that. Cause you know why? I'm not. Don't be asking me why are you so unprofessional. Well, two words. I don't. These these things are not scripted. I'm glad they're not scripted because if I get scripted videos, I'll be so wasting my time. I'm just focused on the channel. I'm not focusing on the script. I'm not focusing on that. I just want the video to be good. And if I, if I say I did YouTube full time, I wouldn't be using the script at all. Because the bigger you are, just because you use a script does not mean you're not you're, you're professional. That doesn't. That, I think that does the exact opposite. It's just it's more enjoyable doing it like this, interacting with my fans. If I made, uh, if I did videos, they would not be scripted. I'll just make on top of my head because I can think of stuff. Or I'll just use stuff from Google. Plus, I got a Google Home right there, sitting on my desk on the, on the TV. So you can probably hear what well, you can't really hear because it's on the other side of my desk. But I hope when I uh, move back downstairs, that's going to really going to change. I, I need something that has room. Right now, it's crammed in here because I have to. If I okay, so when I moved up here before my birthday, I don't think doing the switch up here. Then I had to move everything up here. And that means this is gonna have to go back down. This, this car gonna go back down. No, this computer might be going back. Yeah, it will be going back downstairs because. I use this computer for YouTube because it's, that's how I comment. That's how I, I do the comments on my mother's own computer. Because that computer's mine now because why well, it's not it was it was not meant to be well, I don't know if it was meant to be my computer because 
that's where the trains, uh, because here's the thing, all right? I would have started Trains A New Era when uh, I first got my computer. I didn't know it even existed until, like, like what? Right time I graduated, you ready to like the week before, I'm like, wait, there's a game called Trains in New Era. I know there's at least on the Trains 12. I knew there's another game called Trains in New Era. But I didn't even know it was a oh. I heard that it was a patch, a patch for Trains 12. It's Trains 12, but I find out what Trains 12 should have been. It's pretty much the Trains 12 service pack. This is also that Trains New Era Community Edition. I mean, that, that was so limited. It's like, it's basically Trains 12. Or maybe a tiny few touch up. But I'm talking, I know, when I want a train game, I want something that is good for years. Trains 12 was only good for four years. Trains New Era has been around for three. And I think every year they're going to keep updating this. That game has supported more than Trains 12 did during its entire lifespan. Because Trains 12, it, it started using Joined Rail around 2013. And I, I've been using Joined Rail for a while because it's some of the stuff on there I need to. I mean, yeah, I need to get some new engines from Joined Rail. Two, I need to figure out how I can use them in my, uh, my route because. That game is if, if you don't make the route properly, it's, like, it's not gonna help. Yeah, because I remember when I did, and I, I this is the fourth, the fourth, this is the fourth mile point round I made on this computer. I mean, the first two, they they they, they died, they're, they're gone. And what happened though? Because then the last one, I'm still trying to figure it out. Hope nothing happens to this one because it's. I might be using some references on the other one, but when I make Lagrange on there, that's gonna. That means I have to connect all that. I mean, that's gonna be a big ass pain in the. Uh, pain in the. Pain in the. I don't know. I'm trying to think of. I'm trying to think of a not so mean word to say, but, you know, I don't. I don't cuss in these videos. You know why? Because. I brought this up in several videos in the past. You won't find me cursing in these videos. And you think, oh, he's a small channel. I, I think he would be cursing. Well, not true. I'm trying to keep my channel clean so one day I'm not, I don't look back. And man, was I an idiot? No. I have probably done some foolish things when I've been on YouTube. I mean, the feeling salted will keep going even though, I mean, why doesn't my school like my channel? Yeah, it's got feel insulting, but that's, it's not that insulting. What part of it, insulting are you talking about? Uh, I'm going to have a little bit of a chat with that person that doesn't like, they said, oh, your channel is, I mean, how is my channel very insulting? Look what I've done. I don't, I don't cuss, even though that's too insulting, but that, I, I, it's, it's Mario Kart. What? How insulting is my one? Maybe it's because when you lose, does that make it? Well, I don't rage too often. It's just like because it's only if I find it necessary, and I think it would be a good idea to rage. That rage quit. Uh, just get mad in general because I'm I'm almost rage quit in this game once. I did, because I, cause I kept uh, getting hit over and over again. Like, what's about to happen now? It was like three people at Stars. Uh, it was like the day that I got, I probably like either the day I got to, no, it was the day after. The day after I got this game, I played online, because, you know, like that. I think that I came in the same place. I, it was on this track. This track I'm playing right now, that's... That's what it was, and the problem with I find with some of these uh, I'm gonna get political here in a minute, so stay tuned. But the problem I find with some of these uh, 
so much cost. So these games, if you don't know, if you can't figure it out, by the time I do able to get good at the game, then you know what? You're pretty much enough of that. Uh, now it's time to get to the political rant. Okay, if you remember the last two episodes, number 32 and 33. 32 is my most Everyone thought I was getting away. I was asking for too much, and I totally agree with that. But to the state, CNN is fake news. It is. Why do you think it's fake news? Do I have to explain it again? It's got that one guy named Jim Acosta. I don't think he's gonna. Lie. If if we keep the house, he won't last very long at CNN. I guarantee that he will not last very long. I bet Trump can say, uh, if you insult me again, you're fired. And he's probably going to do if the feel insulted stuff. Or his show, The Apprentice stuff, because he, he has shown any apprentice. He might do it that stuff, because I know the reason he does that is because he's trying to tell the Democrats, hey, I don't want your garbage in this country. I'm trying to make this country great again. Because if you don't know what MAGA is, it stands for Make America Great Again. And this is and this is what Democrats want. MAWA. Making America worse again. That's that's your Hillary Clinton, Clintino, the Clintino crime family for you. Because do criminals help the country out? No. Did what Hillary Clinton help the country out? No. You think I'm sarcastic? No! How many times do I have to say these liberal Democrats? Uh, I'm talking about the really uh, socialist Democrats. Not the, if you're... I think people that are like Kennedy and are Democrats, I don't think CNN would like Kennedy. They might have liked him, but his political views, they didn't know. He was a conservative. He was a he was a Republican crack. That's what that's what they, I call I'm gonna call it's really a party Republican crack. It's Republic it's Republic then A H E. Republic see Republic R H E. And that means uh If that means you're white Kennedy, you're Republican and a Democrat at the same time. But you don't want gun control. You don't want any of that because I don't think gun control is going to help the country at all. No. I'm going to tell you something here. You better get over Trump tweeting because in order to get the message out to all the uh, like news stations like 970, I, 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 all the conservative news stations, which is only two I know of, it's 970 AM and uh, Fox News. All the other ones are liberal. Liberal of socialism. That's what that's what CNN is. I'm gonna try to find. I mean, it looks like CNN's balance. Uh, I don't think so. As you can see, it's placed in a spot where it says anti-Trump. But if you're gonna be anti-Trump, you know what? You need to really think about what you're looking at because you don't know. You don't know what. The president you're voting for it. But let's say Trump was a, was a mayor. I don't think he would be a maniac because he looks intelligent. Even though he did a show of princess, if, he, if he's a businessman, if he wants, he's a he's a political businessman. That, that, that's what you call. And I know uh, the Jim Acosta dude. He needs he needs to just give it a rest. And get his butt off CNN. Because I can guarantee you, if Trump, we keep the house, I can guarantee you, the head of CNN and Jim Acosta is going to have to get their butt out the door. That's just. Yeah, you know what I'm talking about, all right? If you own a company called that's fake news, you would have to change. Your new, the new one would have to change it. Network the TNN, Trump News Network, where they bad math about Hillary, and that would, if a conservative, he would change the company's name, he would change the odds. 
He would say, uh, if you were a Democrat, you're you're gone. Go somewhere else. You're not you're not going on my and that means MSNBC would have to change too. All these channels would have to change the political views to the uh, uh, the right. That's the conservatives or the Republicans, because R and Republic, white and Republican, both start with the same letter. And I think just some of these uneducated Democrats are uh, affecting with our economy right now because all they do is they complain about. They say, oh, the president is a racist. Oh, I don't like Trump because he had to do it. That uh, Putinator. That's our Russia. That's what I'm calling Russian coast. Who's the bad? Oh, crap. Yeah, I'm calling Russia the Putinator. I think what Putin is, I don't find him. A, I think when uh, if we get the house. Okay, okay, but you know what? If you need to leave, Trump would have to get uh, some like other kind of one of our allies say, okay, Russia, you know here's what I need you to do. Okay, put it's one thing I need you to do. Out, bye bye. Your country is done. But you know why? You don't you don't do communism. You don't do communism. You don't do socialism. You don't. You, you, capitalism is better for the country. Why do you think communism is so? Why would you think communism is best for the country? It isn't. Why do you think so? Because all you Republican Democrats out there are probably well. Trump had to do a partial during the election. Now he didn't. You know why? That's an excuse because Hillary lost, and you are not happy about it because. Republicans are tired of it. We're tired of it. We already had to deal with enough of it. And did you get off the stream? Mother, are you off? Why? Okay. Uh, like I was saying, if, uh, if you're not, I think that, uh, I'm not saying this, but what the hell is that? Like, Russia, the thing is, you know, I mean, socialism and stupid capitalism. I mean, oh, what? We just played this track. We just played this track. A couple of races ago, we had. I have to change my car combo to that, uh, what's it called? Pipe frame. Because apparently this, uh, bitty buggy is not a, oh, what? saying about it. The, the Socialist Party is basically the Democrats. There's two parties. There's, well, I don't think there's no not really a Democrat party anymore. Basically, there's the left, which is the Socialist Party. There's the right, which is the concern, the Republican Party. There really isn't a Democrat Party, because you know what? The Democrat Party is turning into the Socialist Party. Because if they keep doing what they're doing, they're not going to get in the house. That's not going to get them anywhere. There will be no house for them because they're not they're not deserving to have the House of uh, Representatives. So you know why? All they do is they protest, they uh say Trump, Trump is a racist. Oh my god. I don't want Trump in this country now. If they, if they keep doing that, they're not gonna win. I mean this election around I mean, let's predict uh 
three months from from now, uh, that's when the election's going to happen. I guarantee you, if they don't clean up their act right then, then, then we are going to have some big problems. I mean, it's, it's 2018, and we're still having this issue. Trump is has... He is trying to help the country out, and you don't think he is, because you, you're like, hey, I want government control. No, you don't want government control. I mean, it's going to take away your freedom of the press. I mean, that's I mean, what Trump's trying to do. He doesn't like that you're uh, disrespecting the flag. I mean, if, cause it, and you're, uh, just because that's freedom to do it, it says in your contract, when, when you, uh, during like the sports, it says in your contract that you will not do that. You will not do the national anthem. Two, you won't. Uh, I don't know what you call. You won't. Uh, if you near the national anthem, I'll get you fired. I mean, you should be fired. Why are you disrespecting us? I was saying a couple episodes ago. Uh, two episodes ago. Like, let's say if I was served in the military, and I died, and uh, you all were disrespecting the flag. And that means I would be one of those who just go, like, what is that for? What did I ever do to you? What did these military people ever do to you? Nothing. They did nothing. They are trying to do their thing, but you don't like us having defense forces. You don't want anything to defend our, ourselves from, like, what, some of those bad countries out there, like North Korea. You don't want that. I mean, yeah, well, look how much, how problematic that's going to be when you say, oh, but I wish I had that. Well, guess what? You said you didn't want it at first, but why do you want, why do you disrespect the flag? I mean, tell me why these idiots disrespect the flag. And I said this in the Michael Wee video. You don't disrespect the flag. You can actually get someone fired. Like, you fired Papa John, even though he still owns the company. He still does. He still owns the company, but I'm really upset that those two idiots had to ruin it for a bunch of people. They, they took away a lot of pride in that company. I mean, you don't uh, you don't do that, people. I hope that I don't want to see that in this watch because if I hear about it again, I'm plugging my ears. The CNN was like, but you had the freedom to do it. No, you don't uh, if you had the freedom to do it, that would kind of be like sticking your finger up your nose. That would be similar to picking your nose. That's the same thing. Uh, the only national anthem is about as bad as picking your nose. I mean, that's kind of disgusting, but if you're if you're doing the national anthem, it's either uh, picking your nose or not flushing the toilet when you're in the bathroom. I mean, if I could take it would I if I had control of CNN? I would take CNN, I would put it in the toilet, and flush it down the toilet. I'd say, bye-bye, CNN. Bye-bye, Jim Acosta. Bye-bye, Carl Zeus. Because you're going to... Those Carl Zeus and uh, Jim Acosta, bye-bye. They need to bye-bye. And then bye-bye, they need to be out of the country so we don't have to hear about them again. They, they would have to pay. They'll have to be in jail for you. Because they both are in a system that's fake news. Let me repeat that. Let me spell that. F A K E. Fake news. How many times do I have to say fake news? If I was if I was in Trump's shoes, the CNN channels, I'm like, no, I'm not taking questions from you. Ask your own questions to yourself. I don't ask, I, I don't answer questions to fake news. Because I if I, I, I don't I'm not putting over that. I'm like, yeah, 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 I agree with you, but you're wrong. Why you, I mean, CNN is wrong about everything. When it comes to climate change, wrong. That's why climate change is a hoax. It is. And what Trump said, hoax. It's a hoax. Don't, don't believe in it because it's, it's a hoax. Don't. I mean, Democrats think, oh, it's one of the big, I mean, that's for control purposes only. And if you, all you're doing is you want more control over the Americans, I mean, that's going to take our freedom of talking about politics. I mean, you don't want that. I mean, you probably say, oh, I want more control over the women because I heard this one story that said 
the more control you have over the what's it called the public, the more it's going to make them want to be higher. I mean, it doesn't make any sense because control. I mean, there should be a lot more freedom in this country to control. I mean, no, not for like they should be able to control the like killing and stuff. I want people to uh, commit crimes. That should be fixed. I mean, and uh, having people defend themselves is going to help. We I mean, don't say. I mean, I hear, I hear people a lot on my channel say, "Oh, but you get too political in your videos." Well, I do it for a reason because it's entertaining. I know. My uncle William said I could do it. And he approved it. I'm like, you know what? I'm going to do that because it's going to teach those uh, whiny Democrats a lesson because. All they're doing is whining. That's it. I guess now we're going to switch to uh, worldwide after I eat this kick that far. <sighs> Sleepy. Tell you, that's pretty decent sleep last night. All right. Car was too slow. Oh my god! All right, here we go. Press the first bomb item bombardment. Because mother, if you could tell me in the chat right now how many times. When I do worldwide races, you think I'm going to get bombarded with items? Tell me uh, how many you think I'm going to get hit by in one go. If I could spam with items. Oh, my. Uh, I just you know, give me a number down in the chat. Just a one. All right, here we go. I got super horn. Oh. oh, there we go. Dodged it. Good thing I had that super horn because I like to keep my first place. Oh, God. You got someone in the mushroom. 
Okay, here we go. Here we go. This is where it could all get kind of dirty here. Oh, great. Here we go. Someone get a blue shell, please. Blue shell. Come on. Come on. Send me a blue shell. Take this person out. Yeah. No. 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 All right. I got first place. Got first place. Here we go. I'll, I'll, I would do a dropout right now, but I think it's kind of too late. Come on. Come on. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, yeah. First place. Yep. We got it. No item. No shell fodder. That's what, that's what I do. If you could categorize me what I am, I'm a shell fodder. Because everything that shell rated hits me. All of them. Like red shells hit me, green. I mean, I can not get sniped by a green shell that I that wasn't even throwing at me. You know, it, it will go past me. Like, about, okay, here I am. That green shell will go past me, but it still registers me, serves me up as getting hit by it. I mean, I'll get hit by something, and it won't even register on there as a hit. Yeah, I mean, it will. Like, you know, it's happened to me multiple times in this game. Like, I'll be in first place. Red shell hits me. And they're on other people's screens. I don't get hit. I'm just moving. Sometimes uh, they'll hit me, and I don't even know I got hit because I'm cause i moving. And there's this one time I really almost made, made my uh, this pro controller I'm using right now break. So about seven months ago, I was playing this at uh no wait where was it uh yeah about seven months ago and I was playing this game online. Um, I think it was it was it on New Year's Eve? I think it might have been like right around that time. Years if I think I was getting kind of mad on the inside because it almost cost me a focus ball because if this if this poker tour starts misbehaving itself, I'm either gonna have to get a Splatoon poker tour or I'm gonna have to get it and yeah. I'm about to be a Mr. Wonk poker tour, but there's a reason or I might get another one one day and if I get another one that'll be the Splatoon Poker Tour. Come on, come on. Oh, do not do the good thing it did not hit me with that. Well, here we go. Oh my. Yep, man, there's, there's one. Let's not, let's not make it two. Oh, please, don't, don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me. Don't hit me. Okay, here we go. Oh. That was like this place to like last. I'm in last place. I need something to catch up. Yeah, mushroom. That's not bad. I think when you get when you get high VR you'll get bad items in last places. The people that are uh, just starting out and they are not in their skill all as well. You'll get bad items in last place when you get high VR. I don't know why it is. It just makes the game. I think it's a balancing problem during the development of this game. Because I think they you're, they're using the same item formula. It's the Wii U version, but they made it more uh, comeback friendly. They, so if you're in last place, you'll be able to get some more power items, which I kind of like that, but it kind of really person that wants to stay in the weed. I mean, I've been able to get a pretty good weed a couple of times because of like I got in them like this bullet bill in second place and I've been able to overtake that first player because they because they I think they did get hit by a blue shell and then I had a bullet bill in the first first place. I don't know how I did but I didn't it didn't happen. It's it happened when the graphic game first came out I didn't Normally, I'm usually in the middle rankings, like fourth, fifth, sixth place. And sometimes I'll take like seven. All right. Nope. 
lost two points. We're stuck around the same area that we were last time. I don't know what it is. Might be doing it. One more, uh, one more worldwide race. I mean, what RVR is like staying exactly the same? It's like we're barely making it. Probably we're just at the same spot. I'm trying to get 600, I mean, 6,000 this month. It might be final episode this month, and it might be. I don't know how many episodes. I have a uh, five, six, seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, forty, forty-one, and forty-two. Yeah, I have. I think it's forty-two episodes left because, uh, depending on how many episodes I can fit in there, that's what's kind of going to change it. Pretty much how it works. We might just go ahead and switch to uh, Mario Tennis Aces. So uh, let me. Uh, that was it for the Mario Kart tonight. I'm trying to that's when I'm starting earlier, so I can be able to get more games in. So who's online? Oh, one's one's on Fortnite. All right. So, uh, I we are now done with my credit the works. Now let me get, uh, get these, uh, cartridge things open. Oh.
说：“莲花圈瑞。”I gotta restart this because I think I picked the wrong one. I have. I think the symbol will be different. Name.
But how come you're not on the string? Huh? I'm playing that Mario Tennis game. I'll probably be doing that for about 10 more minutes. I'm going to be doing Super Mario 3 World. Then I'm probably be doing another game. That's why I'm streaming early. Come on. Kidding me. We're now going to switch to Super Mario 3D World. Yeah, we need to get to this game because I'm going to do it because I want to push it in the animal. Alright. Alright, guys. Let me, uh, let me see something here. Am I am I gonna be able to uh let me get this? You can excuse me for a minute, let me try to see something here. I can get All right. 